On Monday, India's largest e-commerce platform, Flipkart.com, named 33-year-old co-founder Bini Bansal as its new CEO, replacing Sachin Bansal in a move that it claimed would strengthen its management bandwidth as it seeks to combat arch-rival Amazon India and kick off preparations for an expected initial public offering over the next few years. Sachin Bansal, Bini's long-time friend and business partner, has moved on to the role of executive chairman of the company. The move, which was kept a secret even from the company's senior employees, comes as a surprise especially since Flipkart undertook a massive management restructuring less than a year ago. Last February, Flipkart split into three units or businesses, giving Bini charge of its supply chain function. Sachin was to look at new initiatives, chiefly advertising, while its core business of online retail and marketplace would be run by Mukesh Bansal, Mintra's co-founder who joined Flipkart in May 2014 when it bought the online fashion retailer. Bini, a Chandigarh boy, studied software programming at the Indian Institute of Technology, Delhi. After college, he worked at research and development firm Sanof Corp before joining Amazon as a software engineer in January 2007. Within nine months, he quit Amazon to start Flipkart with Sachin, his college classmate and Amazon colleague. The two Bansals, who are unrelated, started Flipkart with Rs 5 lakh of their own money. While the decision to appoint Bini came as a surprise, several people who have worked with him say that he is the best candidate for Flipkart to run what has become a large, complex company with more than 33,000 employees. Bini takes over at Flipkart when it is potentially facing its toughest test, even for a company that is all too familiar with volatility and adverse market conditions. Flipkart is engaged in a high-stake market new share war with the local unit of Amazon.com Inc. and Snapdeal, the outcome of which will help shape the future of India's entire startup ecosystem.